Hello, welcome to Binance Ecosystem Planet. Today, I am going to take you to the futures. Before being an excellent Binance futures trader, you need to finish the following tasks. Task 1. Open a Binance Futures account. Log in your Binance account. Click on Futures. Go to Open Futures account and click Open Now. Your account is ready. Task 2. Transfer funds to your Futures account. The underlying asset on Binance Futures is USDT, so make sure you have some in your exchange wallet. Click Transfer. Enter the USDT amount that you want to transfer. Transfer succeeded. Task 3. Learn about four types of orders. There are four types of orders available on Binance Futures. Limit order, market order, stop limit order, and take profit limit order. You can check out the timing force here. Good till cancel, immediate or cancel, fill or kill. With limit order, you can place an order at a specific price. The order will be filled if the price matches your limit price. After entering the price and order quantity, you can choose buy or sell. With market orders, the order will be matched immediately at the best available price. In order to place a market order, you need to enter the order quantity. A stop limit order will be executed at a specific price after a given stop price has been reached. Once the stop price is reached, the stop limit order becomes a limit order to buy or sell at a limit price or better. You need to enter the stop price, limit price and order quantity you want to place. With take profit limit order, a limit order will be placed when the market reaches the trigger price. You need to enter the trigger price, limit price and order quantity you want to place. Let's move on! Task 4. Perpetual Futures Contract vs Spot Bitcoin trading on the BTC USDT futures contract is similar to the existing spot market BTC USDT contract. They are priced and settled in the same manner, but there are also many differences. With futures contract, you are buying a contract representation of the commodity, which will be settled in the future. With spot market, you are buying or selling directly. Unlike spot market, Binance futures allows up to 125x leverage which can create great profit and significant losses. To open a new trade in the futures exchange, there will be margin checks against collateral. First, in order to open a new position, your collateral needs to be greater than the initial margin. Second, if your collateral plus unrealized profit and loss fall below your maintenance margin, you will be auto-liquidated. Futures fee tiers mirror the spot market but are generally lower. Please note that the volume requirement for each VIP tier is 5 times that of the spot market due to leverage provided. Task 5. The Benefits of Trading Futures vs Spot By choosing long or short wisely, you can trade whatever the market condition is. In this way, you can also hedge risks. Binance Futures allows up to 125x leverage, which is extremely capital efficient. Task 6. The Risks Involved with Trading Futures Remember, high reward comes with high risk. Bitcoin's price can go up and down in a rapid manner, being a highly volatile asset. In the same way that the leverage can multiply your gains, it can also compound your risks and potential losses. In order to mitigate the risks, beginners can start off on a testnet without risking their funds. You can also put a proper stop limit order. Task 7 PNL explanation. PNL means profit and loss. There are two types of PNL. First, realized PNL. Second, unrealized PNL. Realized PNL refers to the profit or loss that originates from closed positions. Unrealized PNL is the primary driver of liquidations. You can always check your unrealized PNL here. When you have open positions on the market of perpetual contracts, your PNL is not realized. When you close your positions, the unrealized PNL becomes realized PNL. Final task: live trading. Okay, let's start trading. 
Let's say I want to loan 0.1 Bitcoin, and right now the price is around 7,981 USDT. I can put a market order, which will be matched immediately at the best available price. But I want to put a limit order at 7,975. Here we can see that the initial margin requirement is 39.88 USDT, and I confirm my order. Now we can see it in my open orders and wait for it to be filled. Okay, so now our limit order is filled. Here we can see the entry price, mark price, liquidation price, and our current profit and loss. In order to control the risk, I'll put a stop limit order. When the price drops to 7,949 USDT, I want to sell 0.1 Bitcoin until 7,945 USDT. Here, if you put the stop price and limit price too close, sometimes it may not be executed. In case the price went higher and I didn't notice, I want to put a take profit limit order. When the price reaches 7,999 USDT, I want to sell 0.1 Bitcoin from 7,996 USDT. And now you can see my stop limit order and take profit limit order in the open orders. You can also close your position with these two buttons, but I would like to hold more. Let's see what's gonna happen. Now the price has reached over 7,990, and the unrealized PNL is more than 4%. As we know, profits like pockets. So I want to put limit order to close my position at 7,993. And the order is filled. Let's quickly cancel our previous stop limit order and take profits limit order. And let's check the trade history. With 20x leverage, I bought 0.1 Bitcoin at 7,975 USDT, sold it at 7,993 USDT. My realized profit is around 4.5%. We can see our current balance here, and now let's move on to something more exciting. Live trading with 125x leverage. We can adjust our leverage with this button from 1x to 125x. Warning, your leverage is high, please manage your risk accordingly. So let's choose 125x and confirm. I think it's a good time to short right now, so I entered the limit price at 9,449 USDT and I want to short 0.01 BTC. Click sell slash short and confirm. Let's go to the open orders and have a look. The order is filled. Let's move on to the position tab. Wow, we're doing great! As we can see, comparing to our futures account balance, when we open an order in a far smaller amount, the liquidation price tends to be hard to reach. That's how we can trade in a safer way with high leverage. I'm not going to set up a stop limit order this time because I'm playing with a very small amount. But when you are trading, make sure you don't forget it. Now I am going to close my position with a limit price of 9,411 USDT, which makes about 50% profit. And let's wait patiently. Our order is filled again, and let's do some math. We shorted at 9,449, bought it back at 9,411. So we got the ratio of the difference we made to our entry price, times 100, and we got the percentage that we earned with 1x. Times 125, we got the percentage that we earned with 125x, which is 50%. Moreover, let's check the graphics. We can see that here the price dumped dramatically. If we close the position with a much lower price, we would have earned more than 200%. But who knows, everything could happen, it could be pumped dramatically too, so we need to be extremely cautious when playing with high leverage. 
Congratulations for finishing all the tasks. See you in the future. The future is now. Binance Futures.